Police say someone kidnapped, pistol whipped, and threw a man into a pickup truck as he jogged near his home in Reynoldstown. It ended miles away in Buckhead after he broke free and then ran for his life. Fox 5's Christopher King tells us neighbors now worry about their own safety because the men responsible are still on the run. The victim jumped out of the pickup truck and ran down Far Road. This is about 10 miles from his home. He flagged down a good Samaritan who called 911. I'm shocked that it would happen around here. Tanisia Charles couldn't believe it when we told her crooks beat and kidnapped a man right in her own neighborhood. It's scary. It's scary. It all began around 2.30 Wednesday morning here in southeast Atlanta's Reynolds Town section. Police say a man was jogging along Bill Kennedy Way. They say three men with guns surrounded the jogger and forced him into a black pickup. It's definitely scary and unnerving. Police say one of the men put cloth over the victim's mouth. The victim told police it smelled like a mix of acetone and vinegar. It's wild, for sure. The victim passed out. He came to in Buckhead and tried to fight his way out of the truck. Police say the kidnappers pistol whipped and beat the man. Anything could happen in Atlanta. He escaped on Far Road about 10 miles from his home. The victim passed out in an alleyway. He eventually flagged down a good Samaritan who called 911. Thought of just getting taken, you know, from somebody in a car while you're jogging is uh, is concerning. Jake Armstrong likes to jog around here as well. He says he is going to be a lot more careful. Try not to be out by, by myself at nighttime. Police say the victim was beaten, bleeding, and may have suffered a concussion. He was taken to Grady. The crook stole his phone, shoes, and wallet. They were last seen driving a black Cadillac pickup truck. Call police if you have any info on this crime. In Buckhead, Christopher King, Fox 5 News.